Sky episode 4, SY-20-12, part 1, take 1. Tried to smother him, living things. This good child is part of it. Eh? Hey? Never mind. Can you get your father's car? To get him to a hospital? Come on, hurry up. What? Pouring the car, Dad. What? Ambrose, where, where's Ambrose? It's all right, Dad. Where, where, where are you going? What, what are my keys? No, I'm going to the hospital. What hospital? It's Mrs. Benner. Jen and Arby have got to be there. What? I, I don't understand. Look, I'll be back soon. Dr. Saul will see you later. Did you get that stuff, nurse? Did you get what he said, stuff, nurse? That must be going round the twist. Do you want a drink? Yes, yes. 
Ambrose was a thick-set little man. Ruddy. Who? Good child. Not at all thin. How on earth did I ever come to think it was him? Anyway, he's dead. He's been dead for years. I want you two to tell me everything you can remember about uh, your friend and this fall of his, right? Well, come along. Come on, anything. You were there. He... He went up to bed, like. Mm. And uh, when we went up, mm. he was... Lying on the bed, sort of... Was he unconscious? No. He said he had a nightmare. Oh. Then he just passed out. Has he any previous history? I mean, has he ever done anything like this before? Well, only when I... No. He was saying something. Juganet. He ever say anything like that to you two? No, no, no. Now listen. If you want me to help him, and he is seriously ill, very seriously ill, I must know the truth. Is that clear? Yeah. Right. What is it, this Juganet? Who's there? Who can hear me? Hello? <laughs> Hello? Hello? I, I can hear you. I can hear you. <laughs> That's clever. <laughs> Call me Tom. I can't have bear being called Tommy. <laughs> Go on. Go on, do it again. You all right, Tom? Shh, 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 a minute. Are you, are you still there? Oh, to sister, is it? To sister. <laughs> it's getting clear. It's getting louder. Where are you? <laughs> yes, yes, of course, yes. Yes, of course I will. Yes, what do you want? Juggernet. No, oh, never heard of it. Hey, I tell you what. Do me a picture of it. Oh, that's good. <laughs> that's clever. <laughs> it's going round, isn't it? Like a circus. <laughs> oh, look at them colours. Oh, beautiful. Fire, is it? <laughs> I do like fires. I think we'd better go and call back again later. Doctor Shaw, look at the flames. Look, Doctor Shaw, look at the flames. Look, Doctor. Ah, you, you made it go. It was all going round and you made it go. Say you're sorry now. I'm sorry, Tom. I don't think so, indeed. Hey, go on, do it again. Now, go on, now. Do them circles again. 
Doctor? Mm? Uh, can we see him now? Uh, tomorrow, perhaps. But it's important that we talk to him, Doctor. Excuse me, What is it? Well, it's gone now. What? The EEG. I called in, he was lying there, everything normal. Mm -hmm. Then I looked at the screen and I've never seen anything like it. Well, like what? A pattern, I suppose. A moving, circular sort of pattern. Glowing and pulsing and changing all the time. Then it stopped. Suddenly. Get me the other notes. But... Now, staff nurse. Yes, Dr. Saul. Hello, uh, Professor Brandt. Uh, uh, Saul here. Yeah, it's something of interest, yes. Uh, a case of mine. Uh, catalepsy. Uh, but with the possibility that trance has been self-induced. Yes. Well, the other feature I thought might interest you, Professor, is the amount of transmission taking place. Uh-huh. Well, the instruments are, are registering a whole series of definite signals in the patient. Look, excuse me, Professor, but it's happening now. You really must see this. Could you come over right away? Right, thank you. Well, as soon as you finish that, then. Thanks. Tom. Tom. Help me. What? You want a biscuit? I am in danger. seen some stones on fire. We had an outing from the hospital once when I was a boy. <laughs> the other said I was mad because I was only one that seen them burning, see? In a big circle. Like wagons. Where, Where Tom? Where? Where? No. No, 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 I can't, I can't remember. I got to do me round. A cup of tea? Hey, say you're sorry, you. Come on, Tommy, back up the wards. Uh, don't you call me Tommy. Go on then, Tom. I'm sorry. <coughs> yes, sir, can I help you? Dr. Saul, please. Professor Brandt sent me. What name, sir? Good child.
Then Dad said he'd been dead for years. So who is he if he's not good, child? And why is he after Sky? Look, Sky's from another time and... <laughs> Look, it's one force against another force. It's like the body. It's like nature, resisting disease. And Sky's the disease? Well, Sky's the intruder, yeah. Now, so why help him? Why not good child? Anyway, how do you know Sky's not doing the same thing to you that good child did to my dad? Look, Sky... All Sky wants is to get away. To find this Juganet and get away. Sky's needed. <laughs> So he says. OK. Suppose there is such a thing as a Duganet. Suppose he can move through time. Suppose he is needed. All I'm asking is what for? I suppose you could say, in your terms, I am to be a god. That's what he told me. I'm supposed to be in here. What do you bring me in here for? Hey, show me them burning stones again. I'll give you a bit of chocolate. Here you are. Huh? What's the matter? Hey! Hey, you're not supposed to do that. You're playing me for that one. There is someone in this building who is to harm me. Oh, they're always at it. That's what they do in Yemen. <laughs> Focus, Tom. Switch off the machine. No. No, not allowed. Tom. Will you show me the pictures, then, if I do? Very well. <laughs> not fire, really, does it? <laughs> it, it? It's more like, uh, more like rays, like, in it? First, you must show me a picture. I can't. Yes, you can, Tom. Concentrate. I cannot see clearly. Concentrate, Tom. Who did you see? The man at the door. What did he look like? Concentrate. I didn't like him. What's the matter? You must get away. I... Hey, hey, you're not supposed to do that, man. You'll get germs. Tom. Tom. No. No. Tom. I've got to go. It's a pity Brand couldn't make it. Yes, isn't it? Have, uh, have you been with the research team long, Dr. Goodchild? I was with the professor in Stockholm. And uh, do you share his views? We must all do our best to ease the burden of pain, Dr. Saul. In a case like this, immediate surgery is often the only solution. I see. And uh, other forms of therapy? Are those the notes? Oh, yes. Feelings of persecution, a sense of being special, it's a typical case of messianic fantasy compensating for social rejection, the old god from outer space thing. The only interesting feature is this paranormal anxiety during self-induced trance, as if you were trying to contact someone. Arby! Arby! Jane! Help me! Help me! Help me! Arby! Jane! Help me! Help me! Help me! Oh, stop it! Leave me alone! Please stop it! I tried, but I can't do nothing! I can't, I can't, I can't! 
Tom, what is it? What's happened? It's him. He keeps on shouting and he won't stop. It's now, him. Now, Tom, there's no one here. No one can harm you. Now, you better get off to bed and I'll bring you some medicine, shall I? Will you stop him? Come on, Tom. Round again. Oh! Oh, for oh, oh, stupid. Oh. Hey, what's the matter? Can't you hear it? Hey, what? It's Sky! Oh, oh, Sky! Come on! Hey, where are you going? Operate. But you don't seem to realise. Operate. Now. A, no permission. B, no need. A and if we do as you suggest, he he'll end up as a cabbage. You agree the condition is critical? <laughs> Not necessarily, no. Dr. Oh, Saul. You agree the condition is critical? I... I agree. Without emergency measures? Without emergency measures? There is no hope. There is no hope of saving the patient. Of saving the patient. Dr. Saul. Nurse. Dr. Saul will be assisting me in an operation. Have the theater made ready as soon as possible. As soon as possible. Tom. Tom. Hide. Hide. What? They'll see you, Tom. Hide. Making me do things. Shh. What on earth are you doing? You must not help, help them. them. Let's get you back into bed at once. But you mustn't understand. I... Very still, please. Tom, Tom. you know Tom. what you must do. Oh, damn. Is everything prepared? Yes, Doctor. Then you may bring the patient. Can I help you? Do I see a patient? You want Mr. Saul? Mr. Saul is operating. You'll have to wait. Hi! Got him. 